Good afternoon, guys. I'm Chris Gonzalez. I'm Anthony Coleman. And I'm Will Savarito. And thank you guys for tuning back into my GSPN game day where we talk high school sports. And as you know, this show is brought to you by GardenGrocer.com and Tulumi Digital Marketing. That's right, Anthony. And we have a very exciting show for you guys today, making our predictions for the district semifinals taking place tonight at Apopka and at Celebration. We're going to go ahead and start off, kick it over to Will, who we got there tonight, man. That's right. I'll be at the 7A District 6 matchup hosted by Celebration. Now, the first matchup at 530 will be between the three-seed Ridge Community taking on the two-seed Windermere. Now, both teams are hot. Ridge Community hasn't lost a game since mid-January. Windermere finished season 14-4, and but Windermere beat Ridge Community 72-44 to earlier this season. Wow. So I'll be taking Windermere tonight, boys. Yeah, Winderman won by damn near 30 last time. Right. And they've been on the hot streak the end of the season. I got Winderman too. That's right, man. They, they, Winderman is one of those teams that they really are shooting a lot of three-pointers in the games that they do play. Mm -hmm. So when they're hot, they're hot. Let's see if they can keep that heat tonight. I'm taking the Wolverines in this one as well. Mm -hmm. So the second game we'll be at, the seven o'clock tip is between the one seed, Osceola, taking on the four seed, Celebration. This is a rivalry game. And Celebration's hosting the tournament, so basically a home game for them. But Osceola beat Celebration twice this season, both by double digits. I don't think it's going to be close. I'm taking Osceola. Yeah, I got Osceola, too. They won the state championship last game, and they're coming off a big loss to Bartow. So I see them getting things going. They're ready for a big playoff push. I got Osceola. Like you said, Anthony, defending state champion there in Osceola. I think they're going to keep that heat. Windermere also made it to the state uh, final four last year, too. So it's going to be good to see, in my, in my personal opinion, if these two teams win, they're going to go ahead and face off on Friday night. That's going to be the game to look for. It's going to be some amazing games for the District 7A, for the 7A District 6 uh, tournament at, uh, celebration at 5.30. Tip off there. It's going to be amazing. But we're going to be at the 7A District 3 tournament where we're going to see at 6 o'clock tonight, it's going to be Okoe taking on West Orange. West Orange, the four seed. Okoe, the one seed. The last time these two met, West Orange actually won by a bucket. They won 45 to 43. But Okoe has not lost since then. And I'm positive that the Knights are going to have revenge on their minds for tonight. The key matchup you're going to want to be looking for is going to be down low. West Orange's Mike McAllister. He's going to have his hands full tonight. He has Austin Andrews, David Green, and Cordell Brown down there that are going to be going in at the basket and are going to be trying to bully down low for Okoe. But where West Orange is going to have the advantage is going to be their backcourt. Joannis Polynice and Garrison Smith, they played exceptional in the quarterfinal against Evans. This game should be absolutely crazy. I'm going to go with Okoe in this one, though. Close game. Yeah, Western seems really hyped after the big come from behind win to Evans. Talking to their coaches after they beat Okoye last time, they think they have a good momentum going to this one. But okoye has been looking amazing this season. They have a team full of seniors, I think like 11 seniors. Right. And they've been one of the best teams so far this year. I got the nice second in this one. Yeah. Now, I featured Mike McAllister on We See You earlier in the year. I really like what I see from West Orange. And they lost to Okoye. I'm sorry, they beat Okoye. But I'm going to take Okoye in this one. They're the one seed, and they've been playing really good as of late, like you guys said. Take Okoye. All right. And then the final game for that 7A District 3 is going to be Host School Apopka coming in at the two seed. They're taking on the three seed, Dr. Phillips, at 7.30. The last time these two teams met, Apopka actually won by two points as well. They got the dub 50 to 48. So an other very close game that's going to be happening tonight. I think it's going to be very similar to the first time around. But this next time, I'm going to rock with Dr. Phillips in this game. I'm looking to see Denzel Aberdeen taking on John Latimer and Ernest Ude Jr. taking on Zach Anderson down low. Those are going to be the two key matchups that you guys are going to want to be looking for tonight. And I'm taking Dr. Phillips in a very, very similar game. I see them winning by a bucket or two. Yeah, it was uh, crazy the first game. The Papa beat DP by two and the whole school. But DP has been looking really good. I really, 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 really like the two sophomores, Denzel Aberdeen and Big Ernest down in the middle. Right. So I got the Panthers winning this one. Yeah, it's a tough one for me. Very close. Both teams have looked great all season. I'm going to take a Popka and John Lattimore. We featured okay. him on We See You as right. well early in the year. And I think he's going to lead them to a victory tonight. And John Lattimore just is coming off a 26-point game mm -hmm. from that last game. Again, guys, it's going to be very, very close, especially in this district. I feel like uh, the celebration games over there are going to be a little bit more lopsided. Right. Yeah. These games right here Tight. are going to be decided by a bucket mm -hmm. or two. It's going to be crazy tonight. But me and Anthony are going to be at the Apopka games. Will and Ricky are going to be over at the Celebration games. And we will see you guys tonight. Please don't press this one when we walk in the building. That's our show for today, guys.
<laughs> We'd like to go ahead and thank our sponsors, GardenGrocer.com. If you are staying in the Orlando area at one of the Disney resorts, place an order for groceries to be delivered to your room at the time of checking. Save money and time by shopping with Garden Grocer. And also, you discover Florida. If you're looking for a new restaurant, hotel, or attraction, check them out on Instagram at you discover Florida or you discover Florida.com. Once again, guys, I'm Chris Gonzalez. I'm Anthony Coleman. And I'm Will Savarino. And thank you guys for tuning back into my GSPN game day. As always, you guys know, your sports, all, all you, you, all the time. time.